Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Fort Worth, Texas, where the, uh, well, bottom of the barrel frauditor known as uh, Manuel Mata is, well, trying to make himself look like a big bad boy in front of the cops. But you know what? He then makes himself look like a whiny little child once again. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I'm over here in the family court, uh, and I came to a hearing, right? And uh, I didn't have no problems. I didn't have no problems in the court, per se, with the bailiff and sign. So I walked outside, and I started taking pictures, you know, of the, like the door. So you were uh, looking for trouble at this point. Okay, gotcha. So you decided to start filming the courtroom door or courthouse door or whatever to elicit a response out of the authorities. Okay, makes sense because, you know, you're not supposed to be filming in a courthouse anyway, so you might as well start there. Got in my face and was like, can I help you? So I ignored him, right? And uh, I continued taking pictures and uh, the bailiff from the inside. Hey, I'm gonna be right here outside. No, I'm not. I'm not going nowhere. I'm gonna be literally right here on the outside. Bullshit! Watched the hearing. Came outside. I turned on my phone. I started taking pictures of the of the the door and all that, right? And, uh... Deputy Kate, C-A-T-E. Thank you. Yep. And the judge and the deputy are going to be talking to the associate judge, and if they get a complaint from someone, a third person, third-party person, that you're taking pictures... Oh, he's going to be taking pictures, all right, officer or bailiff, because he believes it's his absolute right to do so inside of a courthouse. No, no matter how many jurors it puts at risk, no matter how many uh, uh, confidential conversations that might be put on the internet, no, he doesn't care. Any court proceedings or filming any court proceedings, she's going to hold you in contempt and put you in What's jail. your name? Lieutenant Wilcox. I'm telling you what the judge is deciding. I don't care. I wasn't in her courtroom to, for her to do that. You, you can't, can't, you can't stand in the hallway There was no proceedings. Okay, I'm telling you what she said. I, I understand, okay, but did okay. you explain that there were no proceedings that I was taking Mr. a picture of? Stop. The, the judge said no filming of the inside of the courtroom. I, just leave it at that. I can't. Leave it at that. Inside of, in, inside of, of a public okay. space. That's where exactly no, no, where no, I was no, standing no, no. at. I was inside of the hallway. I was not inside well, of the can't courtroom. Film the inside of the yes, courtroom. you can. Well, keep doing what you're doing and get thrown in contempt again. It's up to you. They, she would have did it. She would have came outside. I'm not what is your name? I'm Sergeant Well. Your badge number? 2628. All right. I'm going to follow the plane on YouTube. You. <laughs> you know, what you're doing right now is intimidating and threatening me. Oh, boy. You really are a simpleton, huh? They were not threatening you, you dumbass. They were simply letting you know what the consequences of your actions would be should you continue them in places where you're not supposed to be filming at, you dipstick. That is not threat or intimidation. But of course, I would expect nothing less as far as uh, your inability to uh, understand what simple words are coming from a complete simpleton such as yourself. No, the ju judge, she didn't have a problem with what I was doing. She would have sent her bailiff outside. Mr. Mata. She I'm would have sent her bailiff that was inside. Mata, I don't know what. Y'all can cover for each other. Mr. Mata, we're just telling you what the judge said. If I did. I don't believe you. Do. I don't believe you. That's fine. Don't believe us. Because you're liars, just like right now. I don't have to believe you. I don't, I'm not. We're just telling you. I don't believe you. Okay. The judge would have said it to me. Okay. She would have sent her bailiff out to come and get me and bring me in the courtroom okay. and explain exactly what you are trying to do. It's not an argument. You're full of shit. Okay. 
Y'all both are, and you're a lieutenant, and what are you? Sergeant. And you are garbage. Okay. That's why y'all don't need to be doing this shit, because I have the right to be in there filming. I was not filming the court proceedings. That means inside filming the court proceedings. Y'all are dumb. You know what the rules are. Exactly, and I was following them. If she, yes, I did, then why am I not in hell content right now? Because I didn't do the y'all are talking about. You're a liar, you're a liar. Because if the judge wanted to tell me that, she would have sent her bailiff out Mr. to pull me into the courtroom. Do you use your mouth for anything other than a sewage pipe, dude? Because that's all I'm hearing coming out of your mouth is nothing but a bunch of toxic sewage that has no meaning whatsoever and is a bunch of trash anyway to the point where, well, it's not worth anything to anybody. Because you do realize that the judge... It does have control over the courthouse, the entire courthouse, not just the courtroom. The judge doesn't want anything to be filmed for any particular reason in the courthouse. Maybe there's a damn good reason for it. And maybe it's just because, well, uh, attorney-client privilege, jurors walking around, that kind of stuff, you know. Did you ever uh, think about that? No, of course you didn't. Go do your job, which is nothing. You're garbage. You're a lieutenant. Trash. Trash. That's what you are. You're garbage. Don't y'all hate that? Y'all used to bully tactics, right? Intimidating people. I can go in there and film inside wherever the f I want from a public area, a space. I didn't interrupt the court proceedings. There wasn't any. What they're talking about is stupid. Okay, there's a family walking by. I don't just, care. You just stop. I I, 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 the, I already know the lie. I already know what y'all are going to try to do. I already know what y'all are going to try to do. I'm not going to cuss while they're passing by. Try again. Try again. It's all on Try again. I'm asking you to stop. Try again. You're arguing for absolutely no reason. The, the, I'm standing up for my rights are trying to trample on. You're so big and bad when it comes to dealing with people who, uh, well, won't fight back because of reasons, but I bet you're not so tough when somebody is willing to stand up to you. I'm sure that you'll uh, fold like a house of cards, won't you? Yeah, that's who you are. I've seen your kind before plenty of times. As soon as somebody stands up to you, you just back off like a... Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, dude. I didn't mean to do it. Yeah, that kind of person. Yeah. I told you, girl. If the judge had a problem with what I was doing, she would have pulled, sent her bailiff out. Please, what we said, then go, go do what you want. And if you go to jail, that's on you. Man, shut the fuck up. You're stupid, man. Get your dumb ass back to your little office. How many complaints have you had filed on you? Have a good day. Yeah, shut up. No, wait, you're leaving your pee on. Look, he's trying to jump on with you. Uh, yeah, how many complaints has he had filed on him? Well, dude, I wonder how many times you've been arrested in your entire life. How much time have you spent behind bars? I mean, that's the real question right here. I mean, why should anybody respect you to begin with? I mean, you're nothing but a career criminal thug. That's all you are, and that's all you ever will be. You're just the bottom of the barrel after you get past the uh, uh, scumbags like uh, Chile de Castro. You're what's left when he's scraped away. When the bottom of the barrel has been scraped uh, to its, well, breaking point. So, yeah, that's how bad off you are. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?